Hi everybody, it's Nick. Uh, yeah, it's wet and we uh, are, well I'm trying not to flood actually and they say that at the moment of, um, you know, when, when things are really trying and you're under pressure, you should sit in gratitude and um, think about what to be grateful for. Uh, and, <laughs> and actually what I'm really grateful for is all of my kids and all of my kids' friends who have worked like troopers with me as the water started to rise to, to push it away and stop it getting in the house. And then to um, one of my son's friends who rang his granddad, who rang his granddad who's a builder and he had a water pump and we got the water pump going. So I'm keeping everything crossed that my little um, dugout gully <coughs> And the water pump, um, which Elvis' granddad told me how to do, is going to keep us dry in the house. Because it's the third time we'll have flooded, so of course uh, we're the untouchables as far as the insurance company is concerned. And what's just so amazing is a oh, lovely, lovely guy. He's told me what I can do as a permanent solution to be able to sink a water pump, which will basically save us. Because we have one really weak point where the water comes in our house. Honestly, I'm completely soaked, like look at this, like you can see where, like, if you can see our water's coming in and I'm desperately trying to stop it getting into the conservatory and um, ruining all my nice rugs. So anyway, I am sitting in gratitude for my kids and their mates and how hard they've all worked and um, Alfie's granddad for absolutely saving my bacon. Please just keep everything crossed for me that this works and uh, we get through this wet spell. Okay, um, yeah, so at least the lake will be full of water for my first winter swim on Sunday, eh? Let's look on the bright side. I hope everybody else's day is a little bit more positive than this. Take care, bye.